Hello everybody, I'm the Game Beaver, welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World, the game. Will this series ever end? No! Because they keep making updates. And today, uh, we are doing the Mother's Day Battle event, as well as the, uh, what lies beneath. In this case, it is a repeat, is the Trinitarium, but that means we can get level 20. And of course, the infamous... Dino Preservation! Yay! <laughs> the event that is... L -l literally impossible. Oh, um, one of the hardest events in this game right now. So, uh, just gonna see what we have to collect. So we have an Alanqua to skin. Um, and also I'm tempted in this video to get a better hybrid. Because we have 122,000 DNA. And 23,000 books. So there's, there's no... There's no reason why we can't. Hold on a second, I gotta blow my nose, guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that done. Um, and that leaves only in scappers. Right, but... Now, let low the Dino Preservation is a legendary? Ooh, I'm tempted. So we have a common, a super rare, a legendary, and a Trinitarian perk. And for the Dino Pres- <clears throat> Sorry, what? Sorry, what? You want me to defeat a level 37 Pride Trodon, a level 17 Pride Trodon, and a Suchopterus, level 38. I, um, I, are you joking? Now, what's annoying about this is, if you put in Super Kool-Aid, if you put, really to count this team, you need two amphibians and one herbivore, right? Doesn't sound too hard. But the thing is, uh, you need that amphibian in first. What if they switch to Suchopterus? Suchopterus gets the advantage, has 1,000, almost like 700 attack. 1,700 attack. It can kill Kool-Aid in two hits. That's not cool. Trinicarium pack is mm, easier. The Mother's Day event, which is, you know, a Mother's Day event near T Rexes. Um, oh, oh, oh. oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, just um, make me fight Coolosaurus, Proton, and Ostapasaurus. Yeah, that's cool. How about the Infinite Stage Battle? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Okay, guys. I think it's about time we leveled up. Oh, I'm, I'm, all, I'm all nasally. Ow. I'm not. I'm not technically ill. It's just, I don't know. I'm like dry. Eh. And I've got a glass of water here and everything, and it's not helping. I'm very dry today, boys. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> um. So, really, we're gonna have to do some major leveling up. We're gonna have to do some major leveling up now. I'm fighting. I don't know whether it's because I average. Because look at that, level 4. I fight level 40 hybrids. Legendary level 40 hybrids. And I do not have a level 40 hybrid. Apart from Carnaraptor. Um, but in the top 3, we need a mix. Or a top 4. And a herbivore, unfortunately, is nowhere near it. So I think it's about time we leveled up the dragon. That's what I think we should do. So, I mean, look at all the- look at all these aquatics. Two sticks of sores. I think that's probably for the events. That's probably what lies beneath, we just get them anyway. Two chronosaurs, again, all of these, I think I've just earned. Wait, did I never hatch Lyplurodon? I never hatched Lyplur- oh, that's because there was never a battle under the water, was there? Oh, I guess not. Is, what is- what- what does Lyplurodon copy that was in the originals? What does it copy? Leptoclitus, right? Yeah, I think it probably copies Lep Leptoclitus. Or Lepto- shit, yeah. Um... Right, okay, well, we're gonna go in the hybrids, and... Oh, Ankylodocus would be a really good one! Not even gonna lie, Ankylodocus would be one of the best creatures to get because at level 40 it has over a thousand attack and for a herbivore that's fantastic um and right now we don't have any uh herbivore 
Ah, legendary hybrids. Stegoceratops, not as great, but then again, that's to be expected because it ain't. Um, it's made from a common and a super rare, whereas Anglodocus is a rare and a super rare. Uh, oh, bless me! <laughs> um, oh yeah, that's right, we have Gigacephalus. Which is terrible, completely terrible. Um, Skeletor would have been worth it. I'm kind of glad I didn't level up Skeletor anymore because he got nerfed. And that would have sucked. Ostapasaurus, though, w at level 30 would be freaking amazing. But I've already got level 30 Super Kool Aid. And for 31,000 DNA, Jogon, I'm sorry, we could get a level 30 Pritrodon. But what's the point? We've already got, like, good carnivores. We don't need another one. If that was a flyer, I would have had it. Would have had it. But, um... I want to see... I want to see a dinosaur that is so unique that Ludia have to give it its own animation. I want to see it like a Carnoraptor with wings, but with a re really long legs. Like, something so freakish and outlandishly out there. That's what I want to see. I don't want to see a unicorn wizard. I don't want to see another Gatorade. I don't want to see another flyer. I don't want to see another Ceratopsian, just with a different head crest. I want to see something freaky. You know, these are all very limited. Like, you, you splice two dinosaurs together, and you, you literally get what could... If you... If somebody said, oh, we discovered uh, this thing, Spinoraptor, you'd believe them. Because it looks like a real dinosaur. I want to see something with two heads. I want you to go crazy. Indominus Rex looks like it could be a real dinosaur. Give me something outlandish. That's what I'm waiting for. Like I said, if they do hybrids with the aquatics, I want to see Styxosaur with something else. Like Styxosaur and... Um... Oh, Styxosaur and Elasmosaur or something. And have them, have them have four heads. Have them like an underwater hydra. That would be amazing, but uh, I think that would require maybe a bit too much effort, like too much work for what they'd get, I don't know. Uh, they've got a reason why they're doing it this way, just because it saves time on, on the animation side of things. And uh, not the model, they have to make a new model. So if we buy two more dragons, that's 35,000 DNA, 35,800 DNA, which isn't too much. That'll take us down to about, and then we've got to, of course, um, speed it up. Oh! Ooh, I don't like it! Oh no! Okay, so that is one. We're done! We're actually doing this, we're doing this. Oh, there he is. I, I always lose him. So, uh, and the hybrid. <laughs> Indominus Rex! Oh, you used to be- you are really good! I'm gonna give you credit for the cost of what you are. 2,000 attack, 6,000 health. 2,000 attack. You're- like, you saved 10,000 DNA. Get Indominus, it's so much, it's much better, it's, it's well worth the DNA. Um, and that one, and then buy that back. Right! Here we go, in the lab. Um, so, and then feed you guys, and we're gonna get level 30, and hopefully this will get in the top 5. I'm hoping. It better, because it's the only legendary flyer. Hybrid. There is no legendary, like, herbivore hybrid. Um, go to lab. Oh, that's right, yeah, we need to speed this up. Ow, oh, thank you, flamethrower. Cheers, buddy. So that's two level 30s we've got of uh, the flamethrower. So that's basically a level 40 ready and waiting. So, uh, hold on. 140 DNA, 120 bucks. It's not too much in DNA-wise. Bucks it is, but DNA-wise, it's not much at all. But we have 22,000 bucks, so we can afford this. This is a luxury. Mm, I've worked my ass off for this. So that's another level 20. We could keep it and have two level 20s. But the thing is, at level 20, it's about the same as a level 40 high, uh, legendary flyer. So if we get level 30, it should become the strongest flyer. Ever. So we're gonna evolve again 160 DNA, not too much. A lot for the books, however. That's that's the thing that eats away at me, is the books. 
<laughs> DNA for speeding up isn't too much. Gotta give it credit. I don't mind spending that much on uh, on this. I would expect it in, like, if it's equal for bucks and DNA, I would say, like, it should be 300 DNA to speed this up. But I'm not gonna say that because that's bad and they'll do that. Just to slow us down from uh, getting it even quicker. I really do prefer the old style of the pictures. I really do. I'm just gonna say that. So here we go. Five star, extra coloring, more stripes. Ah, yeah, it's even more colorful. And it costs a ton to feed. Holy crap. Woo so 833 health, 2600, uh, sorry, 2600 health and 833 attack. Um, makes it look amazing. It still has no pupil. It's freaky. Oh. Do you breathe fire? I need to coax it somehow. I just, there it is. Beautiful. I love it. <laughs> So this it should now be the strongest. I hope. I hope it is. Uh, we could probably get a level 40. And then it would like truly be the strongest uh, like hybrid we have. Maybe not actually. But for flyers it'll definitely be the strongest hybrid. And hopefully this will help us out. I don't know if it's going to really help the event. Oh look I just realized there's a camera in the background. Like if we zoom in. While you're squawking away, like a dragon. You see that? There's a camera. Was that always there? I don't think that was always there. Ah, yeah, pretty. So, let's have a look in the roster. Where does it line up? One, two, three, four. Ah, really? Even Megalosaurus is... I mean, but that's a level 40, I suppose. Um, and I have to use Shunosaurus. Okay, we might as well get Shunosaurus level 40. Shunosaurus, get level 40. Because I need you here. As long as we don't have to buy you back. Over 500 attack now. 530. Awesome. Herky turkey. Oh no, I collected all. Oh, I wasted 900,000 coin there. Fantastic. Um, I mean, level 40, look at that. That would probably put it number 2 if I got a level 40. But 85,000 DNA. The thing is, though, right? We can sell things. It's like, what do we do? Like, I have so much DNA. What do we do? I know people have said. I know you guys have suggested. And again, leave down the bleh, leave down the comments below. Tell me what you think I should level up and what we should buy. Because uh, we have a lot of dinosaurs just sitting on our asses doing nothing. Um... But I'm a completionist and I want level, f like, we should literally go through every dinosaur and if we have the level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10, sell the rest of them because I do not care. And it, But that's the thing, if they make a hybrid, I guess we could just get them back later, can't we? So uh, let's have a look. Level th 40, level 30, level 20, level 10. And then all of these Guanlongs are sold. 90, 90, 90, 90. 90, 90, 90, 90. So that's a lot of DNA we just got from Guanlon. How about Fluffy? Well, that's right, yeah, Fluffy, we, um... We can calculate what else we need, because Fluffy did have a, uh... Mama Fluffy and all the babas. Uh, did get a hybrid, so... To get level 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1. Okay, so we can sell 4. So 1... Two, three, four. So that's 400 DNA we got there. Uh, is there any more comments? Maj Majongasaur, so one, two, one. We can sell all these. So sell, 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 and sell. Awesome. I think Majongasaur is the weakest out of them all, though. And then, oh, you threw out a thing, you get 120. <gasps> oh, no, it's 100. Okay, so one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight hundred DNA from that. That's fantastic. Um, look for another common. Because commons, I honestly don't care about. Uh, at this at this point, unless they get hybrids, um, there's no need for me really to have them. And I'm 
depending on when, like early game, you re look at that, I'm three level 40s. I don't need that many. Nobody needs that many. I could sell it for, if it's 520 though, it's like not worth it at all. So, saying that, we could probably sell the rest of them. So one, two, three, four, five, six, I'll, I'll sell those, I'll keep two extra. Um, another common. Oh, Lemo Lemo Lemo! Yeah, because I had to sell this for a hybrid too. Um, so one, two, three, four, that makes a level 30. One, two, and one. So from here on, we can sell three. So one, two, three. I'm just making sure I've got enough to make level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10. Um. Tuki Tukan! Tuki Tukan can! So we can, oh, we can sell loads. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight done. Wow, we, oh, we're slowly getting up the DNA. It's not amazing progress. Cobalt! Oh no! Well, the best we have is level 20 of you. Oh, I'm sorry. There you go, I'm gonna put you in. You, 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 you can get done by the time this episode's done, that's for sure. Uh, any more? I know we have Bonitosaurus and Argentinosaurus. 40, 30, 20, 10. Um, unless the dinosaur that was leaked... Well, actually, the original Argentinosaurus has now been leaked as a new dinosaur. Whether that's a hybrid or an event is yet to be known. But if it's a hybrid, it would make sense that this Argentinosaurus would go into it. Uh, so we have all of those. Oh, look at that! Ah! Who's behind me? Whoa, we can sell one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight times eight is 36. That's 360 we got from that. Bonitosaurus, we have the same situation. One, two, three, four. So we can sell all the extras. So it's one. Two, three, four, five. So it's 400 DNA we got from him. Uh, there, oh no! Oh, Pelicomimus! Oh, that's right, because we had to we had to make a hybrid of it, didn't we? So 30, 20, 10. So that's a level 40 with everything there. So one, two, three, four. One, two, one. We can only sell one. <laughs> uh, and that is as far as it goes for commons. That's them cleared out. 90,000 DNA we're up to now. So, rares. Um, we should have a look at rares because I think some of them we can afford to sell. So, Diplodocus. 40, 20, that's a 30, and then another 20. So, these guys we can all sell. So, 380, 380, 380, 380, 380. So, we got 2,000 DNA from that. Uh, another rare is... Gallimimus. Oh, but we don't have many of Gallimimus. Hold the phone. Are you kidding me? How many Gallimimuses do I have? Oh, 12. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, why do I not have many of those? Uh, as far as rares go, I don't think we... Happy Jara. Level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10. So we can sell all of these. 340, 340, 340, 340, 340. Wow. I have, I have really not done this at all to these guys. Banana beak. Um, oh, must have been a hybrid. So that is enough for level 40. Yeah, we can't sell any of those. Um, let's have a quick skim through. What about Hatsogoptrix? I feel like I missed that guy. Yeah, this one. Uh, level 40. 30, 10. We could probably sell one. We can sell one of those. That's 100. Uh, Dilophosaurus? Just enough, so we can't sell that guy. Um, Pyroraptor? Oh, that's right, we got a hybrid for that, so he's back to level 40. Zing Zing Bajing! Uh, we, he's already had a hybrid, so chances are he won't get another one, or very rare. So, one, two, three, four, that's a level 30. Level 20, level 10. Oh, we're under the floor! That was weird. So we can sell 500! 500, 500, 500. That's 2,000 DNA just from Zing Zing Beijing. Pagasavosaur has got a hybrid, so uh, we need to keep him. Quetzal got a hybrid, but I've started to get them back. Wow, Quetzal! I think Quetzal got a hybrid, I'm not sure. Oh, you look beautiful. I've never actually seen you before. You look like a bird. 
quite gorgeous looking. Gigabyte uh, got a hybrid, um, so it needs to be taken back to its good old self. Um, Allosaurus, level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10. So we can sell all of these. Allosaur, as of yet, does not have a hybrid. 250 for each one. But Allosaur is probably one of the nicest models in this game. I have to say. Monolophosaurus, no. Carnotaurus, yes. So that is a level 30, level 20, level 10. So we can sell four. So one, two, three, four. Beautiful. Uh, Red Bull got a hybrid. And now... Ooh, yeah, I can't get it. I can't get it. I can't sell any of those. But really what we're looking at is probably legendaries. Legendaries are going to give us a lot of DNA. Alanqua, why do I think about you? So you're level 20. That's a level 30. Uh, level 20. Level 10. And then all of these. So 1, 2... Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Awesome. Okay. Evolution complete! Yay! And Cobalt! Awesome! You're a one star now, buddy! You join the ranks of, of all the others. So, I'm just gonna level you up. We might as well feed this while we're gonna do the events. Um, and just evolve the next one, too. Right, okay. I just I just want to make sure I go into these events with the best dinosaurs I can. Whew, okay, okay. Um, so now, for example, Pecky Eyes. This is where we're really going to see the DNA boost. There is so many Baba Eyes. Now, it's going to get a hybrid. It's, it's going to get one. I know it. And it's going to be amazing. It's going to eat so many eyeballs. Um... Actually, I don't know. Maybe... I kind of like it just being the way it is. But uh, let's just make enough for a level 30. So that's a level 30. Level 20. Level 10. So all of these can be sold. All three. So one, two, three. Awesome. Um, we do have a level 40. So technically we could sell the rest if we, if we wanted to. Um, let's have a look at other legendaries that we probably have a lot of. Uh, Spinosaur? Not enough. T-Rex... Ooh, T-Rex. You could go, I think. Maybe. Should evolve a T-Rex here. Ah! Babies! Pretty. Um. What about... No, Shinosaurus. Uh, Superosaurus. Superosaurus! Yeah, look at all those! Literally, it doesn't have a hybrid right now. But we, we can wait. And then one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Done. Oh, wow. This is kind of awesome. Just going through all of these. Ankylodocus, Eupocephalus. Um, yeah, I haven't done the super res. We're just going to have a clean out. This is a complete clean out. Get as much DNA as we can. Uh, rage. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. For some odd reason, in this game, I very rarely get a rage. Um, so, one, two. That makes level 30, level 20, level 10. Just enough to make everything I need for Morton. Uh, Irritator. Oh, yeah, that's right. He was a hybrid. So, throw on a Titan. Attack on Titan. That's enough for level 30, level 20, level 10. Damn, just enough. Grethosaurus. Yes, I know. I'll do the events. Give me a second. I've got to do a clean out first. Uh, Unicorn Wizard? Just enough, nah. We need to keep Frickosaurus is... Yeah, that's right, he had a hybrid. What about Majongasaurus? I'll sell all... They're probably only... Oh yeah, they're not much, so I'll sell all of these. I don't think I've ever had an event that's required me to have a Majongasaurus. <laughs> but that might be because I'm a high level, though. Um, perfect. Oh god, no. No, you, you stay there. Um, I think that might be it. I feel like there should be more. But, like, Sarcosuchus... No. Spanaraptor, no. Trice Triceratops, actually, yeah! It's only gonna give us 50, though, but it... You know what? That helps out with anything. Every little helps! Bap, bap! 
Awesome, okay. Um, Scappers is just getting there. Theranosaurus just got there. Berry is getting there again. Uh, what about Microbosaurus? Hold on. Hold the phone. Because I I did a hybrid. I've already got a level 40 again. And then another two. That's ridiculous. Velociraptor. Ooh. Hold on, Mr. Raptor. So, four. that's a level 30. Level 20. Level 10. We have two extra for the Raptor. So, we might as well sell that. And look at that. We got about... 30,000 DNA just from cleaning up. So that is enough for probably another two dragons. Um, just enough for another two dragons. But what do we spend it on? That's the question. Like, what do we do? Um, right, hold on. Let's have a look at the roster. Sorry, I'm flicking through the menus like a madman. Um, let's have a look. We don't have a good herbivore. But to get Antarctica Pelter... Up to this point, I don't know if it would be worth it. I think we're, we're best, actually, getting Ankylodocus to level 40, if we do anything. And we, we could already buy three of them. So, let's have a look, actually. Herbivores, um, Antarctic Pelter, level 40. Nah, not worth it. An Ankylodocus is so much better. And only costs 3,000 extra... Ec bleh! I cannot talk today. I'm all nasally too. <sniffs> um, yeah, it's about 4,000 extra DNA, but I'd rather get a better uh, herbivore. So I think actually we should get a maxed Ankylodocus. I'm going to kick myself though, because I bet there's going to be a herbivore hybrid coming soon. I bet. But, you know, that's still pretty good. The only thing is, if I get high-level dinosaurs, higher-level dinosaurs, then I'm going to be fighting higher-end-level dinosaurs, too. So, it's like... If I get an Ankylodocus, it makes whatever below it redundant. Because I will not use that, or very rarely use that. Um, so, I think we only have a level 20 Ankylodocus right now, a dippy. So, we'll get a level 30... For another 20-odd thousand DNA. Sorry, yeah, level 30. Um, but to get level 40, we need to do another 40,000. So that's 60... Probably about 65,000 DNA to get level 40. But we don't have a good herbivore. It's probably worth it. It's probably worth getting at least... At least a level 30 of this. So that's what we're going to do. Because then we have a, a herbivore that's probably, probably better than Antarctic Pelter. And we got a good herbivore, so that's what I'm going to do. We're going to get a four star. So get you. And then feed, feed the dippy. Yum. Done and done. God, hybrids, man. They eat your DNA like it is nobody's business. So evolve, go to lab. Oh, that's right, it's done! Awesome! Oh, you! How much am I gonna waste? Like, five bucks? <gasps> Three bucks? How dare you! Close enough, close enough. Because then we get level 40 of you, and depending on if I feel like it, um, we might hybridize the commons. I don't know if it works out cheaper, that's the only thing. So, uh, Angladarkus, evolve. 80 bucks? Not bad, not bad at all! With hybrids, I would always say it's worth getting a level 20. Because if you get a level 20 hybrid, it's not as good as the things you've hybridized. Almost, it's not as good, depending on what it is. The new hybrids that are both legendaries, at level 10, they're better than what you've, uh, than what you have. But everything else, it's, you need level 20 to make it worth it. So there we go, and then evolve 140 DNA, 120. Takes us just below halfway. Damn it, now it takes us to halfway. Oh, look at all my glorious books. I've lost 4,000 in this episode. So there we go. Four star Ankle of Darkest. Hopefully it'll have over five. Oh, yeah, it's got over 500 attack. It's, all, it's already better. I think. Like, okay, let's have a look. 
Uh, yeah, an extra 200 attack exactly. That's a bit odd. And 300 extra health. Yep, much better. Okay, so we have a good herbivore. Whew, okay, so we have the dragon level 30 now. We have Ankylodocus level 30 now. Um, I'm just wondering how much better Ostapasaurus really is. There's something sneaky about it. I don't like Ostapasaurus. I think because I was so attached to Super Kool-Aid and then it was like they made a new update and decided to have a better hybrid as in a better amphibian hybrid. And it was like, I feel like it just undercut Super Kool-Aid. Like Super Kool-Aid really didn't have its time to ch time to shine. I never got level 40 and then before I did that, there you go, Ostapasaurus, level 20. And it's literally on par. So, I'm just wondering, Ostapasaurus, level 30, I think we'll get that next time. I think in the next episode, we'll get Ostapasaurus level 30, because look at that, 1,200 attack, and that's level 25 for it. And it's got so much more, it's got 500 health on Super Kool-Aid. It's gonna put it second, at level 30. It may even put it first. A level 30 Ostapasaurus may dethrone Indominus. Phew. Phew indeed. Okay, so this is the Mother's Day event. And I gotta say, it's not being very kind to me. Uh, so we're gonna put that in. We're gonna put in Super Kool-Aid. And then we need to put in Shunosaurus. So... Cross my fingers, I'm crossing my toes. Are we gonna win? <laughs> Nobody knows. Okay, we got the advantage. Look at that. Look at that for an advantage. He's probably gonna switch though. Does, okay. Whew. Whoa! Oh god, he can kill me in one hit! If I lose this dragon, I'm gonna go for the risky play. I'm gonna go for risky gambit. And hopefully he won't attack. Of course he does. Not do not only does he attack, but he goes for one. The minimum it needed. So that's my level 30 dragon wasted. God. Uh, one, two, it's dead. It's not dead. I have to go for that. Jesus. I have to go for three attack to kill this. And I have the advantage. And I'm a hybrid. So he can kill me in two hits. Which he shouldn't. Okay, good. Right, okay. Um, Shunosaurus, you've got half the attack. Please go in and act as a meat shield, would you? And let him waste all of his- Oh, he went for three blocks. Thank God I didn't attack. Attack now, though. Go for all. Go for four. He went for three! He's got one block! <gasps> Super Kool-Aid may do this! But this is the thing. I've used, like, my best dinosaurs already. Uh, so he's got one block. Okay, uh, I'm gonna say two hits can kill me. So, oh no! I should have run for three block. Okay, I've got, I'm crossing my fingers. Hopefully you won't attack. Cause I'm pretty sure it can kill me in two hits. Yeah, you can. Don't attack. Don't attack. I've got four. That would be risky. Okay, one. So he's got three block. He's got three block, but I can kill him in three. Yes, we did it! Oh my god, and with Shunosaurus, not even a hybrid, we took it out. Oh! That was insane. Oh my god. Whew. Mother's Day battle event. No! Are you serious? No! And the way wants me to use Dimorphodon? Oh, you are having a laugh. This is ridiculous. No way! Okay. Ankylodocus killed pretty easy. That's okay. I'm not too worried about that. Indominus Rex is kind of a problem. Um, because, I mean, we do have Ostapasaurus. And he's got a thousand attack, basically. So, maybe it's not too bad. I think... <laughs> I really do think we need Indominus Rex. No. I'm gonna put in Pritrodon. Pritrodon. Oh. 
Then... He's probably going to switch to Super Kool-Aid. So then we need berries. Then we have berries. And then hopefully... Oh... Hopefully Super Kool-Aid doesn't kill Pritrodon. Let's have a look. Okay, Pridoron comes in. Anglodoka switches out for Coolosaurus. He may attack with one. If he attacks with one, we're still alive. Um, and then I switch to Dimorphodon. Go for all reserves and blocks. Sorry, reserves. And then he switches in Anglodocus again. So hopefully Anglodocus can kill my berries. I need something to kill Super Kool-Aid. So... The whole thing is crossed. Ah, oh, this is gonna be... Horrible. I feel like I'm gonna die. Literally, I think my, my team's dead. But we'll see, we'll see. So they already waste the go switching out, so they waste that two player advantage. So the second go advantage. Um, oh, we switched to Indominus! Indominus Rex has more attack than a level 31 Kool Aid with its. Oh, a bit like with its 50% boost. That's kind of terrifying. There is six levels between them, but they, they, it shouldn't be that big a difference. Oh no! He went for two! Okay, okay, not looking good, not looking good. So he's got nothing though, right? He's got nothing. I'm gonna switch in this guy. Oh, he's got 5,000 attack! Sorry, health. Okay, okay, we've done it. We've still got two. We've still got two reserves, so they shouldn't go for an all-out attack. Two hits can kill us, mind. Um, don't kill him. Oh, thank God. Ooh. I need to save this guy. I need to save this guy. So I'm going to switch in berries and hopefully berries can meat shield this off. Hopefully. Uh, I'm going to do this. He's got th two block. One block. Okay. Come on, berries. Berries! Hit me! You can't hit me! La, 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 la. Ah! <laughs> okay. Okay. He went for a full out attack there. He had five. Um, Super Kool-Aid probably can't kill me in one hit. So one, two, three, it's dead. One, two, three block and two reserve. I hope. Please, Super Kool-Aid, don't kill me in one hit. That's a lot of attack if you can do that. Okay, we've won. I think we've done this. I think we've done this. Please attack. Please attack. Yes! Awesome, we did it! I don't want to look at what the next battle is. I really don't. This is the strongest battle of my entire game. Of the entire entirety of playing this, I'm facing the strongest creatures I've ever seen. And we're still doing it somehow. Okay, 150 DNA. God, I need that. And the last one, um, Spinoraptor, Pritrodon, and Coolosaurus. Oh, I need Gatorade? Caprosuchus? Are you serious? I need... <laughs> you want me to use a super rare? <laughs> oh my god, okay. Well, you better level it up and get at least to 100 attack. Ooh, just below. You know what, guys? I think it's about time we got... Uh, sorry, Gatorade up to level 30, at least. If I'm using it now, I kind of need it to level 30. Luckily enough, it only costs 60 DNA and 30 bucks. Whew. Whew. This is an exhausting episode, by God. Okay, Gatorade, you're leveled up. Right, let's get you to level 30. You need at least 100 attack. You do, sorry bud. Oh yeah, first time done. It, oh, Gatorade's working with me. Come on, buddy, let's do this. She knows. She knows. She's about to go into battle and she needs that coloring. Oh, now it looks like a leopard or a cheetah. 148 attack. Awesome. 80, 100, sorry, 880 uh, health. Which hopefully is enough to survive a single attack. I hope. From a Spinoraptor. Yes, it is. Awesome. We can actually use it. It's got to actually scare out Spinoraptor. And then bring in Super Kool-Aid. And then we need a flyer. <laughs> Which all I've got is Scappers. And then I think Connoraptor. 
I think that's it. Because we don't have a... We, that's it. Actually, hold on. Capra suit just goes in. Spanaraptor switches out to Super Kool-Aid. Then we... Hopefully, Super Kool-Aid can actually kill us in one hit. Ooh. Ooh. And I think it might do that. I think it might do that because it looks at the rest of my team and goes, Yeah, you're dead. Because if that's the case, then we've only got three attack. And then Scappers kills Super Kool-Aid with three attack. But then we've still got Spinaraptor and Pritrodon to take out. And Carnaraptor level 40 cannot do that. So, for the sake of getting a level... Actually, hold on. We need a level 40 Gatorade to win this. Unless we buy back something. Unless we buy back a really good Amphibian. Now we need another three Gatorades. We need another three Gatorades in order to get a level 40. And... Oh, I don't know. It's, it's cheaper to actually buy back Super Kool-Aid. It is actually cheaper to buy back Super Kool-Aid. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy back Super Kool-Aid. Have Scappers. Worst case scenario, it's Super Kool-Aid versus Spinaraptor and Pritrodon. Let's see. Let's do this. Oh, look at that 222 attack. Yeah, you better be scared, Mr. Quackers. Okay, don't attack me. Please don't attack me. I knew it! I knew it! I could tell from the get-go that was going to happen. So we need to go for three attack here. We need to go for one, two, three kills it. Now if Gatorade was a level 40, that wouldn't have killed him. Okay, he can kill me in two hits, which he probably... Sh he did go for! Okay. Now, now I'm scared. Because I have to kill this thing in three hits. Now, Spineraptor has a thousand attack. 500, 1000. I don't think Spineraptor can kill me with three. I don't think so. But it's whether or not I risk it. Because I would rather kill Pritrodon than. Uh, then fight Spanaraptor. Sorry, I'd rather kill Pritrodon than actually reserve. It's just... If he can kill me in three hits, I'm dead. If he can't, then we've won. He's gonna have 500 attack. 500, 1,200. Nah, nah. I don't think he can kill me in three hits. I don't think he can. Come on, then. Go for three. I dare you. I dare you. Come on. I don't think it can kill me. Oh, no. He goes for three. Can it kill me? Oh, I didn't! Yes! Suck it! <laughs> Badoosh! So, all I'm doing here, I just won the super rare pack. I don't care about bucks. Don't care about... I want DNA. Two DNA, please. All one. 700. Oh, that's worth it. And a Quetzal. So, it's basically... Another 500, maybe 700 DNA. So that's in total 1,400 DNA we won there. And that, my friends, is going to have to end the episode here. There's been so much and there is going to be so much more in the next episode. So if you enjoyed it, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye. Dominates the waters with his rainbow fury. Dick.